<laughs> Why you kick my dog? Why you fucking kick my dog? Ah, maybe. Let's just do it right now. I am gonna go make the... Scratch some homes out. I'm gonna turn the team home into... We went to the wrong home. Into my old farm. So you guys can, uh... Have a geese at my, uh, broken heart. Where do we start? I think I'm gonna make it over here, though, in the cactus area. And then for anyone that wants to come over here, they're just gonna have to, like, make their way over here type thing. So, yeah, so for anyone that's new as well, this is where I'm gonna make the new team home. This, there's two massive boxes, basically. So one side could be for, like, sword fighting pvp and the other one could be for crystal pvp that's what i'm thinking and then we just have a big open entrance in between the two and then you know like if it swaps over if you know let's say if you're doing crystal pvp and someone like runs over to the sword side then you're not allowed to crystal pvp no more you got to go to the sword fighting or i don't know something crazy like that but yeah here was another crazy big uh big um bump um, also, Gillet, appreciate the follow, my man. I don't know if, um, I said anything. I don't know if my alerts came up. Okay, slash team. Let's, um, before we go, see this is the team home. Let's see what the old team home looks like. If it's still the little obsidian box. The old little obsidian box. With some weird ass wood. Oh, hello. Hello. Weird ass wood. I just wanted to see what this looked like for the last little, you know, couple of seconds. Uh, last couple of seconds. Hello. Hi. Um, okay. Now, time to set it as a new one, boys. Time to set it as a new one. So this doesn't really change much. Got a little messy. But uh yeah. Team set home. There we go, boys. We have a new team home. She is a mess, but you know. She isn't too bad. She isn't too bad. But yeah. She is what I'm thinking is maybe eventually we destroy all of this. Uh, you know, just so we can make it like a real big obsidian box or something like that. Um I have plans with it. Um, but yeah, maybe I could even do a little bit of work on this right now, actually. Yeah, let's, I'm gonna do a little bit of work on it, actually, right now. Change things up, gives me a bit of a different thing to do from the, um, cactus farm. For anyone that, for anyone that wants to also join the team home, uh, uh, join the team, sorry. Um, all you gotta do is join my Discord, which is this here. And once you've done that, there is a verification tab. You've got to click the diamond that gives you, um, makes it so you're verified into the server. And then there's a channel in there that um, is for like asking to join my team. All you got to do is just um, put your name down there and I'll invite you. Simple as that. Pull that down. Feel free to have all these hoppers as well. I don't want any of them. I don't want any of them. I'm just gonna make this place look a little, a little bit nicer. You know what I mean? Alright, this is um here. Yeah, I'll show you, my friend. This is all raided, so I'm now turning this into my team home. Um, here, I'll, sh I'll show you a couple of things though. Um, so this was going to be my new cactus farm. Sadly, like one of my last streams, I actually uh, leaked my cords. This was my uh, kelp and pumpkin farm. So I'd done myself a mischief, you know. Um, basically, you just go slash set home. And when you go home, these are your homes to pick from. So you only have these two, two homes um, to pick from. For your team home, if you want to do a team home, go slash team and then go set home. Space in between. So this was all kelp farm. It was a six by three chunk, uh, seven high. 
This was pumpkin three by six chunk nine high. Um, yeah, I was very, very rich. Um, and now, yeah, sadly it all got raided because I leaked my cords. Bye bye, Ed. Uh, but now I am making a new, I'm making a new cactus farm. But yeah, I'm turning this into my team home so we can have a crazy an arena. So this is my new cactus farm. Did a lot of clearing off stream. A lot of clearing. So uh, here's the start of the new cactus farm, and she's already, you know, getting juiced. Um, to get more, you've got to um buy plus, which is five USD. What you do is go slash store, and then you click on this link here, and it will um it will bring up uh, a page on how you buy it. So yeah, this is gonna be the new cactus farm basically. So we're gonna have a cactus farm here, 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 and here, and it's just gonna be fucking giant basically. Um, for anyone that's new here, I don't make small farms, I and I don't have an ending. Once I've finished it all, I'm just going to dig out more and make it even bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger, you know what I mean? So, uh, that's what I like to do. So yeah, so this here, since when I was rich, because, you know, of my other two farms, uh, it's definitely worth it. It's 100% worth it, because also you get shards, doesn't matter where you are. So you can always get shards, doesn't matter if you're on the spawn or at your homes, um, you're always getting shards. Um, then you get to five homes. Then if you need like resources from like the random TPs, it only takes 30 seconds. So say if you need like sand and you get like trees or something like that, like a fucking forest, you can teleport in 30 seconds as well, which is also kind of helpful. And so basically the main two things though is you get three extra homes and you get shards everywhere. So if you like to get spawners and stuff like that, you don't have to AFK no more in the AFK place. Because you just make a big farm and you can get money as well as shards. So I've got three accounts. Um, well, I've got two, but then there's Danny's account as well. Danny DeVito is my mod. He's, um, he's on his way to my house right now. He was here just before, but he went to the shop. Um, but his computer's literally just like right here. Literally just like right next to mine. Um, so yeah, our three accounts all have... Um, Oh, the alerts do work. Hey, I appreciate the follow uh, rate. Rate you saw. Appreciate it. Um, so, yes, yeah, so I've got all of them plus basically just for the shards. Yeah, bro, blow it up, blow it up. If that's, uh, it probably is easiest to blow it up, to be honest. We'll just clear this whole thing out, bro, eh? Um, so, yeah, so that's how you get more homes. And I definitely reckon it's worth, guys, because it's only $5. Just remember that, 5 USD. Very cheap. Very cheap. If you guys are younger and um, you don't have any money, you could potentially, because of how cheap it is, you could potentially do chores for your um, parents and, um, and get $5, you know, like an hour's worth of chores, two hours worth of chores type thing. Should be good. Yeah, I've got a little bit of a, uh, a little bit of ideas with this place, just because since there's two, two um, you know, big areas, there's this area and the other area. Definitely reckon, definitely, definitely reckoned we should have one for sword fighting and then one for, um, for crystal. I reckon that'll be a good idea. How many does your cactus farm make a day? I've only just re literally made it, bro. Um, but cactus and pumpkin is uh, the best, like, selling thing. That's for, all, like, for automatic farms. Fully automatic. I always thought to make a big cactus farm, but it's too much work. Uh, bro, read a source. What I recommend, bro, is 100... Like, so I'm basically pushing everyone in my chat to buy... Like, to make a cactus farm. The reasons behind it, because... Cactus and pumpkin sell for the most um, for fully automatic farms. You can, you know, like have a fucking manual farm of like cocoa beans or like berries um, that you're going to put bone meal into. But to be fully automatic, it's cactus and pumpkin. And cactus, you don't need any redstone, observers, or pistons. Every other farm that's automatic, you basically do. This is the only one that you don't, so it makes it very cheap. All you need is literally sand, wood, and cactus and you're away type thing so that's why i recommend it for everyone like because 
like if I was so basically when I next get raided, um, which will happen, um, when I next get raided, I'm gonna send all my money off to Cam's account. Um, basically, I don't. I, I'll probably try it. Will be very long and boring. I'll probably end up spending all my keys and just trying to make it seem like I've got a brand new account type thing and start from scratch. And the first thing that I'm going to do is probably cut some wood down to get some money, just a couple of K or something like that. And then just like while I'm random TPing, just try to find a desert, set my home at a desert, or I've got my sand to make my cactus. Now I need a home for like trees, which is I don't. Because it's just literally probably every random TP. Or you can just buy them because they're so cheap. So I'd literally just straight away start and um and just make a massive cactus farm. And it will just get easier and easier to make. Once you get enough money to buy a drill, then you can clear out areas a lot easier. But at the start, you just you know you're gonna have to mine it like all like slow and tedious and stuff like that. Um am I able to buy um I don't have any skeleton spawner, bro. Um, and I, I don't actually, if, also if you're trying to sell skeleton, I'm, I'm, don't buy or sell skeleton. I'm an iron golem type of man. I've got, um, I've got 293 iron golem spawners. Thoughts on cactus sky bases? Um, in all honesty, boys, I probably just don't actually recommend ca uh, sky bases in general. Um, just because all my viewers that have ever like all my viewers that have had a sky base have all been raided apart from the one that i literally just seen today but um yeah every um sky base i've come across has been raided so i don't know if it's like um like easier to find or something like that but yeah i always recommend just go down to as low as you can and go from there that's what i recommend Hey, from Dubai, how we going, my friend? How we going? Um, so fucking all bases basically got raided, so I've just, um, I've just turned this into the team, new team home, and we're just clearing it out so far, me and, um, me and Joe Donut, we're just clearing it out, and we're just gonna basically make it a big, um, PvP arena. Hey, my day's going great, bro. It's the weekend now, bro. Finish work for the week. Gonna be streaming the next four days, bro. I've just been wanting to stream, but the other days are just not the best because you know, majority of people are at school or asleep at the time where I'm wanting to stream and stuff. So, yeah, how about yourself, my man? How about yourself? How is everyone? How is everyone? And is it Friday for everyone? Is the weekend? <clears throat> yeah, definitely every base I recommend to build is recommend underground. Unless, you know, like, you're literally just, like, putting, like, one chest, like, at sky limit, or, like, two chests at sky limit, like, then that might be really hard to find, but if you're doing that, I also recommend putting, like, chests underground as well to fuck with the raiders or the potential hackers. So what I do when I'm placing, like, my iron golem spawners and shit, I normally place them underground underneath lots of obsidian, and then I also place lots of random singular cheap spawners down as well to fuck up the pie chart or just to fuck with any um, potential like x-rays or something like that. Till Thursday for you? Ah, that sucks bro. One more day, one more day and then it's the weekend. How good. Everyone be on the weekend soon. How bloody good. Okay. And when I was making this cactus farm as well, for anyone that's new here, um, I was like making it like because I was rich as at the time. Um, where's the other farms? Here, follow me, my friend. The other farms, the other farms are way more messy, bro. There you see it, the little gap, the little gap. <laughs> here are the other farms that are also uh been poopied, but these ones are gonna be a bit more. Feel free, feel free to start grabbing, if you want to grab all these fucking, like, pistons and shit here, there's a lot of pistons and observers and stuff, but it's just, this one here is going to be so much more cunty, because there's so much water here, like, so much water, um, 
But yeah, these were my um, big farms. Um, so basically, for anyone that wants to TP here, you've got to join the team. And for anyone that wants to join the team, you've got to join the Discord, which is that there. Then you join the uh, Verify page, which literally just turns you into a member. You tick a, there's like a diamond, and you'll see like 50 plus people verified by it. You click that, it makes you verified in the page. Then there'll be a channel. Sounds like a lot of work, but it's actually not. Then there'll be a channel that just says like, um, join my uh team and you just drop your in-game name there and i'll um once you've done that i'll um happily invite you to the team but yeah i've just done the same step for everyone that's joined the team so i don't want it to be like different for anyone else you know and then it also pushes you guys for anyone that's not in the discord it pushes them to go through the discord and join my discord and that's kind of where i like keep an update with you oh, i'm yeah for you said no uh, i would say before i made the other farms first so I was going to make this farm last, and I was just going to make it, like, basically, this was just going to be the richest cactus farm ever. Once I was done this, I was going to make it over there. As you can see, all the bottom blocks are all iron blocks. I was going to make this whole thing all out of obsidian. So I already said to everyone in my chat that if this ever gets raided, this is the perfect place for, like, a big arena you know because i've already done one whole wall i've already done all the floor now it's just this that and that type thing and this here was already like over two million dollars just in obsidian just to do that which is pretty crazy so you know i've got to get my farm back up and running to you know be able to actually finish the job type thing i spent quite a bit of money on here for no real reason so i thought it would, you know be funny but yeah, so anyone that wants to TP, you got to join the team, and it sets the team home. Nope, team. Invite. Iris. <clears throat> um, so Iris, Iris, if you are already in a team, um, you've got to leave your team. But if you're not in a team, what you've got to do is you've just got to re-log. And once you've re-logged, let me know when you've done that, and I'll happily invite you. Yeah, it just makes everyone re-log for some weird reason. Basically, everyone that's joined the team's had to re-log. I can just basically just every now and then just, um, just type it and you'll, um, how do I leave my, um, so what you do is you could type slash team and then type leave. Or if you're the host of your team, so that's if someone else is the host. If you're the host, then type disband, which is D-I-S-B-A-N-D. And that will destroy the whole faction if you're the host. And then once you've done that, you'll probably still have to re-log. Um, and then I can send you an invite, my friend. But yeah, this is just going to make the fucking the PvP area a lot so much like so much better. Because for you that just seen that last one was just terrible. Eh? It was just way too small. Um, once you got like six plus people there... Uh, You'd start like just hitting, you'd be having a 1v1 and just be hitting everyone type thing. Hey skeleton, leave me alone. I'm hoping the drill's gonna, ah, uh, not the drill, the um, will die by the forms. I've lost them, I guess. Yeah, this is definitely gonna be a lot more tedious than, um, um, there you go, my friend, you have, um, Privileges to teleport to the team base. Yeah, this is going to be a lot easier than the other one. Like where the, all the pumpkin and fucking kelp was. There's so much water there. We're probably going to need a sponge for that one. This one here is not too bad though. Especially when you're fucking using the drill. Oh good. Gonna change so much before the water gone. Hey, too easy, brother. You enjoy your snack. What are you going to have for a snack, bro? What's the good old Australian snack? I got myself some snacks. I got myself some, uh... Got myself some licorice. I got myself some chips. Ro roast pork and apple sauce chips. I didn't get any of these myself. I got some hickory lamb. I got myself a big old chalky milk. Got myself some crackers and cheese and salami. And 
some fucking cookies. Hell yeah. And some fucking cookies. Nah, not black, bro. Definitely not black. I don't like black licorice. No, 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 no. Red. Red. Raspberry favorite soft eating. Nah, I don't like black ones, eh? I'm with you there, bro. I don't like the black ones. Back in the day, I didn't even like, um, licorice. Like, at all. Like, when I was probably, like, fucking, like, 12 to 15. Probably didn't even like licorice, to be honest. Um, but now that I'm 26, I don't actually mind it. It's quite nice. It's different. I wouldn't, you know, like, this bag will probably last me, like, a while, you know? Like, I won't just sit there and smash it in one sitting type thing. <clears throat> Oh, the ice is just so pleasant compared to everything else. No, there's no water, how good. What type of snap, uh, snacks do you guys like? They're like, no normally like I like to grab like chocolate and stuff. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not actually a huge snack eater. Like I'd prefer savouries all day, you know, like I prefer just to eat food over, um, over that. Um, have you sent your name in? You have indeed. Uh, team. So basically I am, I used to have an old team rule where if you left the team, you were not allowed back in. Now it's like you can leave the team and I'll happily invite you back in if you want back in. It's just mainly because that was the rule just because like, I, I wanted to try prevent the team home from getting like raided and stuff like that. Like now if I'm making the team home, you know, like a big fucking arena type thing, then um then we should be good, you know. We should be good. Yo yo yo. Um I like cheese and bacon balls. Oh yeah, they like they like chips, eh? They like chips. Two seconds boys. Two seconds. Oh fuck, I came back to fucking get him beat, what the fuck? Who paid that spider? I know it was one of yous. I know it was bloody one of yous. Damn, the base is looking honestly like so much different compared to what it was like five minutes ago. Do some crystal PvP, get people to do crystal PvP here at the start just to block all the fucking like fences and shit. And then like once that's all blown up, just turn it into sword fighting and then turn the other one to PvP. Cool. Leave me alone, spider. What did I ever do to deserve this? I thought we could be friends. I thought we could be friends. Why though? What's why though for my friend? I don't know when I um oh for the glowstone, I'm just lighting it up if that's for it. It's just so um so mobs don't spawn. Cause they can get annoying when like um fighting or just even clearing at the meantime. I hate the skeleton shooting me. It's so annoying. Um, is all key? Wait, is the key all? Wait. Um, no, it does do, it does give random, so it's very, I don't know what the percentages are, but you can get all of the other keys. I've gotten every single key before, but I have, as you can see, been playing for 29 days. Um, I haven't gotten a lot of them. I want to say maybe I've gotten like two golds, maybe like three amethyst, three primes, two crimsons, maybe something like that. Not like a crazy amount type thing, but yeah, you, you do have a chance to get all the keys. You can have them. I, I've got lots of iron um, golem spawners, remember? You boys, you guys keep the iron. Gonna have to dig like a fucking area out somewhere here. Maybe I'll just do it like right here. Wish the drill worked on obsidian. Just took maybe a little longer or something like that. Look, this takes a long time. Bruh, we could even leave the fences potentially. The fences is gonna be very like tedious, you know. Like, you know, we could let people do some, you know, like crystal PvP in here or something like that, and they might blow up the fences in the process of doing crystal PvP, you know? Because the fences, like if we go along doing all the fences, that's gonna be a lot that's not gonna be fun, boys. That's not gonna be fun. 
I don't know why I'm gonna do this. Probably good enough for now. I don't know where the center is either. either. But, uh, it's so nice mining up the ice compared to thing. Oh, if you like, if you guys ever need any like meat or um like raw meat or um deep slate, there's some shulkers up the top of the cave there. All just like rubbish though. How much money is this gonna cost, boys, for the obsidian? That's a real question. I'm pretty sure it's gonna cost a couple million dollars. I'm not even gonna lie. <laughs> I was trying to make this base as expensive as possible without like being a like ridiculous price range. For <laughs> uh, the obsidian, bro, for the walls. Just for just for the obsidian floor and the fucking obsidian wall there. Um that's where um like it costs like two mil. Um uh, send me a TPA here, Bronzo. My bron uh, my name's um Captain T V. <laughs> you have friends over, Bronzo. Do you have friends over? <laughs> Damn cheeky swastika. What do you mean, bruh? I see your swastika. <clears throat> yeah, that's all up there. Yeah, fucking... I, I didn't need any of that stuff. I just kept it all up there. Feel free to go hard and have it all if you want. Um, should I start making holes in the floor for glowstone? Um, Yeah, feel free. Feel free. Feel free. Should I start making the walls? Maybe I'll start placing some walls down. It's gonna. Uh oh. I'll fill up my inventory with whatever space I got left. Huh? Yeah, which is great. Because, yeah, this is gonna be so much better than um our old arena. Just because, like, there's times like. Joe Donut, last stream, he um wanted to have a 1v1 with me, and we had a 1v1, and there's like six other fucking people there, and like, we keep hitting them, because they keep fucking jumping, right, around and stuff, and like, it was total accident that we're hitting them, but it just made it so much harder, and it like, it didn't come down to skill then, it came down to kind of luck, because you know, like, if there's lots of people jumping around, and you're constantly hitting them, then you're not actually, did, like, damaging your opponent. And then the other opponent could be fucking you up or oh, I don't even know. So yeah, hopefully more room is um better. Okay, we need more more bloody obsidian. You kick my dog. <laughs> Why you kick my dog? Why you fucking kick my dog? This of water is fucking enough. <laughs> this is where the next one is. So we've basically done the first one already. Just with three people. It took like fucking like less than an hour. Like shit actually gets like done so quick with you guys. Like helping. It's fucking great. Okay, yeah, that's that. Now where the fuck's this water? Is there more? Bro, there's a whole nother fucking base. We don't have to do this side anytime soon. Have you not been to the other side, bro? This is... This is... This is... Bro, this is... This is the easy side. <laughs> yeah, bro. <laughs> bro, this is the easy side. I thought we'd just start on the easy side, you know, and then we could do the hard side later. I'm just watching you slave at the wall right now. Here, I'll come after you've gotten to the corner. I'll, sh I'll show you, bro. Bro, you're gonna you're gonna be like this is a fucking mess. Just, unless that's just like no, I don't even want to be. Unless like that's just fucking Joe Donut up there. It's kind of hard to see with the fucking um the name um crouch. But yeah, is it is it you up there? Oh there you are. Yeah, come come look. This is where I opened up. This is where it gets messy as fuck, bro. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Welcome to my other mess. <laughs> You thought the first side was bad? This side's worse. Way worse, bro. Look, no, no, he's gone, bro. He fucking just left the game. He's fucking done, bro. 
fucking left the game. <laughs> Rage quit it. Oh, fuck you, dude. He's like, nah, this is too much. It's too fucking much. <laughs> Surely. But yeah, what the fuck? This is nasty. So yeah, that's the pumpkin and uh, kelp farms. Yeah. The Kelp's going to be the easier. Yeah. Because they didn't get blown up. <laughs> yeah, so we don't have to do any of this anytime soon, bro. This is going to be, you know, a big project that we're probably just going to do chip away tiny as at. But um, what I was thinking, bro, is since we've got two massive as areas, what I was thinking is one side for sword fighting and then one side for crystal PvP. So then they don't mix up. You know, so if you want a sword fight, you be on one side. If you want a crystal PvP, you can be on the other side. Just because we've got two massive areas right next to each other. But, uh, yeah, pretty crazy. Yeah, this, uh, this side here was the easier side. Way easier side. <laughs> that other side's a nightmare, bro. We don't have to start that anytime fucking soon. <laughs> can you please come with me and kill someone? Uh, uh, no, Bronzo, you just TP'd me to a fucking swastika, sticker, so I won't be TP'ing to you for probably, like, the whole start of the stream, or maybe the whole stream. Um, <laughs> it's trying to get me banned from Twitch, bro, what the hell? So, yeah. <laughs> yeah, bro, Bedrock, uh, not Bedrock, um, Obsidian's expensive, bro. I reckon just, like, stop it there, bro, if I can... I'll, um, I'll probably end up chipping away at it off stream sometime and we'll happily, um, happily, um, spend all the money into it and stuff. You guys spend your money on your base and stuff. Ah, uh, that's, that's not my fault, bro. You're the one that led me there. So you were the stool, the mastermind of the whole scheme. Because whoever idea it was, you were the one that TP'd me there because you knew that I would happily TP to you without hesitation. So, it is 90% your fault, I would say. Uh, who said I was going to stop? <laughs> if you don't want to stop, my friend, I, I really appreciate it, bro. I really appreciate it. But yeah, feel free to stop at any time, bro. Any time. Uh, I'm going to do a little bit of um, cactus work, boys, because I started. I need to start um, making uh, my profit up again for... So I can start sending you guys a little bit more money and start working towards getting to Bell Top. Because currently the cactus farm is going great. But you know, with me I just don't have an end goal. I'm always just going to make it bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. So that's what I'm going to do. But what I think I'm going to do is, I like this new method that I'm doing. Is I'm going to do all of this here. Like place all the fences in the sand. And then all the cactus. And then that's it. I'm going to let them grow up to three high again and then once they've grown or even two high then i'll do another level just so then it's just one step less that i gotta do i don't have to place cactus on top of them to put signs next to them um type thing we will need some cactus we need sand and fences i think we've got enough fences just sand and um but yeah, maybe later, Bronzo. Maybe later that I can um, TP. But yeah, just um, just keep that in mind. If your friends are trying to, you know, like TP trap me and stuff, you're the one that's gonna be punished, bro. Like if you TP trapped me right then and, and I lost all my gear, bro, I would have probably ignored you and then I wouldn't have TP to you probably, you know, again. I would have happily come and fucking like sent you money when you needed or like fucking talked and all that. But you know, like. Don't make your friends, don't let your friends, like, fuck up what you have here, you know what I mean? And that goes for everyone, you know? If your friend comes around and they're like, oh, like, bro, fucking TP trap him, or, like, do that. Oh, I've got another set, bro. I've, I've got another set to chuck straight on, straight away. I appreciate that, Joe Don't Know. But I'm just, yeah, I'm just trying to, like, say, like, just don't let your guys' friends, you know, like, like, if your friend's nagging you, bro, just be like, just be like, nah, like, just... I can start nagging them, be annoying to them, be real annoying to them, start annoying the fuck out of them, <laughs> bring up someone that they like, or something that they find really annoying, or just be real annoying to them, just, just change the whole conversation, yeah, yeah, do what they're doing to you, but do to them, you know, <laughs> okay, this is like this, and then this is like that. Okay, now the sand. So 
because yeah, that suck. That suck if you know, like, if you guys, uh, I don't know, fucking not like I wouldn't ban you or something stupid like that. Um, but you know, sucked if you know lost like your like Minecraft privileges. You know, like me TPing to you and stuff like that. You know, like I might forget down the line and like try TP to you and then realize that you're ignored and then be like, oh well, you obviously got ignored for a good reason. So, but you know, um, chat's a bit different on here. The only way you'll get ignored on here is or like timed out or muted type thing was by like saying naughty words or fucking. Abusing others, <laughs> questioning the admin. <laughs> Is he really chat? Is he really? <laughs> I can need to drink some more water. Well, no one's again. Yeah, no one's redeemed to them. Not I'm not allowed. I'm not allowed. <laughs> For anyone that doesn't know, I've added some new things into the channel as well. There's like another little point system. Um, it's basically just like um, you get points for being in the channel. It doesn't go towards anything. It's basically like a flex, you know, like you can be like, I've got more points than you. I've like, I'm, I'm a better viewer, you know, like type thing. Um, so yeah, so Danny's got 860 points. Um, you're first on the leaderboard. So there you go, boys. Fucking Danny's first on the leaderboard. Out of 15. Um, so also for anyone new as well, I'll be advertising just for this month. Um, Twitch is giving, um, subscribe, um, what is it? 30% off subs at the moment. No, it's 25% off subs at the moment. Um, and that also gives you towards like, um, you got 910? How the hell are you? No. I don't think you do. Um, <laughs> but yeah, so that gives you extra points. It also makes it so you don't get ads in the channel. It gives you lots of little perks and bonuses, basically. <clears throat> but yeah, I added a whole lot of that stuff into the Discord channel here. I should bring it up. It might make it a little bit easier to explain. Um, so where is this? And it also, um, it also supports me as well, boys. So, uh, this subbing, this is kind of what it gives you. So you get mugs, you get animated emojis and emojis, which I'm also looking for people to help me out on Discord, if you guys have emoji ideas. Um, this is just support, and then this is what these new point things here is. So every five, uh, so every 10 minutes you guys get 5 points, and then it, subscribers get 15 points for every 10 minutes, so they get a little bit more, and then this is how you get extra points as well. Uh, but you can do little games with them as well, uh, I can do little raffles, um, you can do duels with your points, so if you, you know, like if you want to get ahead of Danny, you know, like you might want to set up a duel with him, if he's keen to do a duel, or, um... There's bingo, I think I fucking got. I don't know how we do bingo, but yeah, this I'm trying to get um some new things involved in to like Twitch so you guys can feel more amongst and stuff, so you're not just like watching or just like watching and chatting. Because I know there's a lot of people that just watch, they don't chat at all. Um so if you guys want to also, you know, get amongst on the the points and stuff, which would be cool. Uh, Bronzo, I will not be TPing to you for the stream, bro. Especially when you keep telling me to TP, um, after I've already told you. Um, yeah, you, just a reminder, you did want to show me a swastika, sticker. So, yeah, it's not really, uh, acceptable, mate. Not really acceptable, yeah? Nah, that's, uh, that's different. That's, um, different, um... For firm debate, um, so, so Danny's probably got like thirty thousand or forty thousand of them, or something stupid like that. That that's a different set of um points. Um, so them points, that's how you like um can get VIP. So I lo I know a lot of people are, are trying to um get VIP in here, which is just like kind of like another little flex. Now, so I've set up a whole another little um. No, you're not making me angry, bro. I'm just, um, just saying that, like, you just, 
I'm not going to TP to you because you kind of did something naughty and I'm I'm punishing you, you know? Like, you're in timeout type thing. Look at it like that. You're being punished because you tried to TP me and show me a swast sticker, but as soon as I seen it, I turned around pretty damn quick. Um, so, yeah, so, like, you're not making me angry or anything, bro. I'm just um letting you know. you got to be punished for what you done, naughty boy. Um, but, yeah, so it's a different point system, so you can do, like, um like, what are mine? Like, uh... Points. Cool. Whatever then. I got zero points. Um, but you can do like um you wanna do a a bingo? I think you can oh you can do exclamation mark commands and I think it will show you guys the commands. Or oh, I don't know how, or it might show you a link to the commands. Um How do you bingo though? What's this do? I don't even know what that even does. Oh, you don't get points at all. No, I don't get points. But what, how do you do bingo? Maybe I've got to reset up bingo after stream or something like that. I'm trying to just learn up this stuff. I'm just trying to um, make it so that you guys can do a little bit more things in chat. But you guys surely can duel, um, potentially. So there's all the commands you guys can do. Um... They're all the commands you should be able to do. Just to give you just to give you guys an idea on like what um extra things I'm adding into the server. Sorry, what was that? Oh yeah, so you guys can check your watch time as well. Um I know a lot of you guys were trying to check your watch time like maybe a week ago. So I'll put that up now so you can see your watch time. I don't the only sad thing is I don't know if it's starting from now or if it's starting from when you actually very first started. Hopefully it starts from very first started. Um, what else is there? I think I've done a raffle or something like that. I can set up a raffle. Can you do that one? Um, I got through it. It's is it S as well? Yeah. So, uh, that there, what's that do again? Yeah, I let the cactus grow a little bit. So if you don't want to let the cactus grow, you can just let the, um, you can, what I do is I place a cactus on it. If you want to, like, so I've already just started doing this, just so it gives me a bit of a break, basically, so I don't go brain dead from just doing cactus, 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 cactus. But if you just want to keep doing up, I recommend instead of placing a block above it, bro, just place another bit of cactus and then your fence, and it just saves you, you know, like having to break it. So that's what I recommend. I've really just thought about this like within the last couple of days. <clears throat> um, so it looks like there's a couple of things maybe offline and stuff. Maybe not all things are working, boys. Sorry, but um, I no, will. It's working. It's working. I'm just going to get uh, the. Pro I'm at six hundred and eighty points. Mm -hmm. The person in second is pretty sore. Yep. With one hundred twenty-five. Roared with Killerton. Damn. <laughs> so, uh, the new people at the top. Yeah. Hey, I appreciate you guys for being here. I appreciate you guys for being here. Appreciate everyone for being here. Right? You guys actually motivate me to stream, eh? Like, this whole t time that I wasn't streaming, all I wanted to do was just jump on my PC and just start streaming, but it was just the worst timing for me, eh? All you guys were either in school or asleep or working. It was just terrible timing. So, um, yeah, I was just, I just really wanted to fucking stream, eh? Uh, I'm trying to make a cactus farm. Never made a cact farm before. Um, so we'll, Danny just put in there. Um, you can find my YouTube, bro, and there's a small little video of me making a cactus farm. Or I can, or you can kind of look here, and I can kind of like teach you as I'm building my cactus farm how to make it. Um, but so basically, what I recommend, so say if this here is the bottom layer, bro. So say these aren't fences. Say this is like cobblestone or just any building block. So this is the very bottom layer, basically. What you do is you put your sand on your um, layer above that. You put your cactus above that there and then if you want to like so as i was saying before if you want to put your fences above it what i do is i i literally just 
build up another layer like this and put a fence like that and snaps it so it just saves you the time you don't ever have to bring out your pickaxe the only thing that you really need is maybe a shovel and an, and an axe just to break the the sand and the wood but um yeah so doing it like this you don't really need the thing so i'll quickly just build a small little portion over here just to show you how i do it i also when you're doing this i also recommend you wearing armor as well um just to save you from getting injured because you will get injured uh this one here is going to be a little annoying because i'm going side. but what i do is i jump on cactus twice sometimes it doesn't let you jump as well and then i crouch walk to here and i stand up and when it's just under that line there i basically just jump and place the cactus and now i'm on the fence now i've got my sand block and i'll do the same i'll place the sand and i'll constantly what you got to do first though is you're going to place all the cactus so if you don't place cactus seeds you can see you can't kind of clip it but for this one here since i can clip this one here then i just place the cactus fence and sand cactus cactus fence sand so this is basically just how i do it you've always got to start from one side you can't from uh start from the middle because if you started from the middle um so say if i started from the middle and started going this way here um once the fence is placed here I can't place another cactus block on here to place this fence. I'll have to place another block, to be honest. Uh, well, to, just because it won't grow. Um, hey, too easy, brother. Too easy. I appreciate you being here, my man. appreciate you being here. So, yeah. So, this is how I'd set it up. But in the meantime, yeah, just to give me a bit of a break, just because I've done so much cactus before, I'm just literally just going to um, let it grow. So, after I do this and do all the sand, I'm literally just going to let it grow. I'm just going to break that there and let it grow. Oh yeah, on my YouTube as well, you can, um, you can find, like, my VODs, basically, they're just, like, all the long videos of my Minecraft videos, they're basically VODs of my, um, stream, just cut down a little, like, I've edited them a small bit, like, where I've, um, like, left to go toilet, make food, coffee, all of that, etc, um, I'll cut down so that none of that's in it, but, yeah, so, and there's also four farm videos as well, there's a cactus farm, a Sugar cane farm, kelp farm, pumpkin farm, and a kelp farm. I just said that twice. I was so spotty. I'm so tired as well. Sorry, boys, if I fucking muddle up a couple of words. I'll have a good sleep in tomorrow. Be nice and fresh for tomorrow's stream. It's just been a long week this week. Been a long week. Been a tiring week. I don't know about long, tiring week. Bum, bum, bum. How's Joe Donut going? How's Joe Donut? How's the old cactus farm? You getting rich, my friend? How much money you got? Surely you're getting rich. Oh, but that's right. You did say you haven't uh, really AFK'd your farm yet. What's that? Farm gets AFK'd. Woohoo, money, money, money. Hey, you have a lovely time, Joe Donut. I know you're going to absolutely waste them, but don't waste them too much. Go easy on them, eh? Go easy on them. <laughs> Enjoy hockey, brother. Enjoy hockey. I enjoyed hockey when I was younger. <laughs> Wasn't actually bad at it as well. I love being the shit out of people. Actually, actually real good at hockey, actually, back in the day, because when, you know, like, when you're young and stuff, every kid just wanted to, like, smack the ball as hard as they could. And it's just not how you do it. Yeah, I was good at golf for that. Yeah, I loved, I loved golf as well, though. But as I grow up, I've just, like, gotten lazy. <laughs> or enjoying my uh, video games. I you weren't lazy before. Did you? Not as. <laughs> I mean... Not in schooling days. Like in my... In primary school, I was the fastest in the whole school. Like cross country and shit. Like everyone in my school like always fucking... Like expected me always to come first and all the fucking stupid cross countries that we did with other schools and shit. I was just a little beast back then, eh? And then I just started playing video games, I guess. 
A leprish. You want a leprish, sir? Feel free to grab a leprish. Definitely gonna have to do some duels today as well, boys. Definitely gonna have to do some duels today. For anyone new here as well, I quite like doing um like sword fighting duels in common gear with uh, eight golden apples, one totem, and all that. Just because I can't really do crystal PvP because of the lag um for me. So I quite like to do some duels, so I still get to do PvP and stuff. So we've got quite an impressive uh, team base now for that. So that should be good. How much money does this make in an hour? In all honesty, bro, I wouldn't be able to tell you. I have no idea. Um, we could we could test it out after I um finish doing this. I'll empty it. And then I'll do an hour time, alright? The only hardest thing is for me to remember. Well, do we get up? No, we do not. Hey, pity. Appreciate the follow, my man. Appreciate the follow. We are struggling to get up. Oh, I hate getting this. is the worst part about... Okay, we got on the... Okay. And we missed. Typical. Appreciate the follow, my man. But yeah, I'll, um, I will set up a little timer. I don't think I'll do an alarm. I'll just have an, a, a timer because the alarm can kind of be quite ear piercing, and I don't want you guys to, you know, don't want to make your ears bleed. So I'll just do a normal um timer and every now and then check on it. This is annoying. I got to do this last little section overlap this with fences. Can't do this with um cactus just because the cactuses is, will stop growing because of this uh fence here. G'day potato, how's it going my friend? How's it going? Hey pity, how we going guys? How we going? So I'm just making a whole new base guys, cause um because my old base got raided. I'll um show you pretty soon. I'm just gonna quickly finish off um this level here, place the cactus and then that's what I'm gonna do. Cactus shouldn't take long, this is just the most tedious part. Okay, what to do with this bottom part here? Okay. I'll be right back, chat. Um, I'm just going to quickly go to the bathroom. Or it'll be like a couple minutes. Um, but yeah, be right back, guys. Won't be long. 